But I saw a perfect God. Just before I give my life to Christ. Oh, you made mistakes. I want you to come here. I just want to have a handshake with you. You don't want anything to deprive you of God's blessing today. I want you to move forward. Come here. That's what song we used to say. I have decided to follow Jesus. I have decided to follow Jesus. Come here. Come here. The Lord is asking you, don't let this glory pass before you. Do not resist the anointing of God. God is a gentle spirit. He cannot force himself into your life. The Bible says, to those that receive him, he gives the power to become the children of God. So we cannot do anything without receiving him. He gave you his life. Believing you will give him yours. He gave you his life. On trust. Believing. You will give him your own life. God is waiting for somebody. So we pray. There is somebody here. The Spirit of God is pushing you to come. As you are assisting yourself. God is asking you to come out. It's your time. As you are assisting yourself. And the Lord is still showing me that person. Come out. 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 You are resisting yourself. When you come out, I will know. I will pray. And 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 I will pray. In the name of Jesus. 
Mwenyeri ya Yesu Christu. In the name of Jesus. Mwenyeri ya Yesu Christu. I want you to say after me, those of you in front. Just lift up your two hands. Those of you in front. Should lift up your two hands. And say after me. And I want you to be loud as you speak. Say, Lord Jesus. Thank you. For this moment. Thank you. For welcoming me into the kingdom, into the kingdom of abundance. Thank you, Jesus, for forgiving my sins. Thank you, Jesus, for writing my name in the book of life. Thank you, Jesus, for turning my captivity around. Thank you, Jesus, for giving me a new song. I receive you, Lord. As my Lord, and my personal Savior. And I confess that only Jesus Christ of Nazareth, only the risen Jesus Christ, is the Lord and my personal Savior. In Jesus' name I pray. Say Amen. Give a hand for Jesus. I'm going to pray for you. And after praying, I will shake each and every one of you. And it's a special impartation. I will shake you so long before we pray. I don't want the devil to blackmail anybody here today. So that's why it's important to do this first. Because the Bible says devil is accused of the brethren. If, if, I not, if I have not done this, the devil will have a loophole to fight us, to accuse you. They will shake the devil. And the God has done And the two people Era abantu wakatona mungu leo. So we send the devil. Era tu swa ziza stand. In the name of Jesus. Muri nyeri a Yesu. Lift up your hands. Mwani kemi kono jamwe. Father, in the name of Jesus. Tata muri nyeri a Yesu. As these hands are lifted up. Jine mikono ngai jwani kisu. So is the blessing lifted up. Era no muki sababu. As these hands are lifted up. Era ngazi jine mikono jwani kisu. So is the success lifted up. No kuwangu ra kwa. As these hands are lifted up. So their destinies are lifted up. And this eyes are lifted up. And so their future lifted up. And this eyes are lifted up. So is their progress lifted up. Father, in the name of Jesus. Say amen. So is their progress lifted up. So is their progress lifted up. And this eyes are lifted up. I speak life to each and every one of them. Say amen. So is their progress lifted up. The spirit of death hovering around. I take authority over you and tell you. In the name of Jesus. None of them here. That have received Jesus. Will be condemned. In the name of Jesus. I proclaim. And decree. Lord life. Over them. In the name of Jesus. I speak of my business. I speak of my career. In the name of Jesus. I take full authority. I take full authority. I take full authority. Over generation setback. Listen to me. I, I speak it to you right now. And you know I'm speaking to you. The word of the Lord just came to me. You have just given up on life. Because each time you walk back steps, you take 20 steps back. But because I'm here, and because of the anointing, that yoke is broken. That yoke is broken. In the name of Jesus. No more setback in your family. I break that curse. I break that generation of wickedness. I break that generation of wickedness. In your family, in the name of Jesus, you will be the first. Go and rise up in your family. 
speaks to you. God changes your captivity. People God was waiting for. Be a Jew, so we'll see to speak to them directly. And they just confirmed it. Why God asked them to come? Why God asked them to come? And God located them. And the last person I just, the last person I spoke with, was the dead God's grace. He said, I have come to you. I don't want to go into details. Because I spoke with her confidently. But I told her today, the mission has visited your home. Amen. That you may give life to that child. Trust in the Lord. God is a spirit. God uses people to bless them. Amen. Amen. So today, we are going to pray simple prayer. Very simple prayer. And it is done. I want you to see miracles happening in your life. But I want, you to, I want to tell you something. God told David, anointed him as a king. It took 30 years. It took 30 years. God promised to come to pass. God promised to come to pass. God promised six months. Took me through steps to get there. God promised the Israelites deliverance. It took time. But God is telling me yours will be immediate. In the name of Jesus. Once that yoke is lifted off your shoulder, go and do exploit. Whatever you touch is will be blessed. Many of you will go their own businesses. Many of you working will see how God, how you find favor before you Once you have an idea, you can tell your boss or 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 your boss. Now, my personal prayer is for God to raise 10 rich people. 10 rich people. When I mean rich, people that will take care of the house of God. God needs generous givers. In the Old Testament, in the Old Testament, the people gave 10%. In the New Testament, they gave their all. Because they saw the manifestation. So we need 10 people. God will bless. And you will determine if you are among those 10. If you determine if you are among those 10. Through how you pray. I'm not going to ask you to raise money. God has not called me to do that. I can bless you with money.